of the East. Jack Burford Chevrolet presents Race Week at the Richmond Raceway in Richmond, Kentucky. Here's your host in all things racing, Bill Lupino. Hey everybody, welcome to this week's episode of Richmond Race Week, brought to you by Jack Burford Chevrolet. Bill, it's been a while, but tell us what's been going on. A lot. <laughs> <laughs> you know, we raced back on uh, sure. August 7th, okay. and then I started not feeling good, and right. ended up having that little virus thing going around. That's right, absolutely. And I was pretty much dead to the world for like eight to ten days, just right. couldn't even pretty much get out of bed, and had the right. fever, and then the guy's just telling you, sure. spread it all out, and right. went down to 94. Absolutely, right. Felt even weirder. Right. Um, you know, worked our way through that, mm -hmm. and... Still not 100%. I may start coughing. Apologize sure. if I do. And, you know, still have some other right. issues. Sure. But we're alive. Absolutely. And then, you yep. know, we did plan on racing last week. It was supposed to be our lock it in night of mm -hmm. provisionals. Mm -hmm. And, you know, people may not realize this, but we had almost six inches of rain on Wednesday. Yes, we had a bunch. Yes, our little rain gauge was at the full five and overflowing. We did. And we couldn't even get on the track till Saturday. So it wasn't like I just wanted to cancel. Sure. It's sure. like when you can't get your grader and your equipment on your racetrack, right. you can't right. really do too much. You know, we're here filming. It's Tuesday mm -hmm. today, and mm -hmm. we do have some more showers coming tomorrow. Sure. But, it's but not as bad. No, it's supposed to be like 0.3. Yeah. Exactly, right. You know, we already have a plan that is like, if we get that, we should be in really good shape. Okay. You know, I already have my plan to get out there and do what I normally do when we have the water and all that. We just need to be able to get on the track. Sure. sure. And then we plan to be good to go. So, this weekend, racing at the Richmond Raceway, give us the details. Fourth annual Damn Yankees 50. Nice. Which is a pro late model event, okay. um, $5,000 to the winner. Okay. The first three years, it was a fast track sanctioned race, okay. which is the parent company of Ultimate, who okay. I work for. Wait, right, you know, exactly. So, right. me taking it away from fast track was definitely a tough decision because mm -hmm. I kind of work for the company. Sure, exactly. But what's going on with it is there is the national tire shortage. Right, yes. And... The crate spec tire, which is the only one they can run with the mm -hmm. Fast Track Series, mm -hmm. is pretty much unavailable everywhere. Okay. And people just cannot get it. So it was in the best interest of our local racers and regional racers and, you know, myself too. Sure. To pull it from Fast Track. Right. Run it with the track rules, track tires. They can run what they normally run. And so we are running it just unsanctioned this year. Okay. So that is Saturday. 50 laps. $5,000 to the winner. Nice. 5K, yes. people. 5K. And then last week, like I mentioned, was supposed to be the lock it in at a provisional. Yes, so right. I didn't want to take that away from two of the other classes. So right. our Eagle Finance UMP Modifieds will be running for their usual $1,000 payout. Okay. But the winner will get a provisional to our Bluegrass Nationals, which is the end of October, and that's $3,000 modified race. Okay. So the winner will lock themselves into that, which nice. we were supposed to give away last week. Excellent. Excellent. Then my American Racer South Super Stock Series. Right. Supposed to be in action last week for the 1200 to win with a provisional for the 5,000 to win second annual Lonnie Center's Memorial, which is October 2nd. Okay. We move that series event to this Saturday. You moved it to this Saturday. Yep. Okay. And we're still going to get that provisional away also. Okay. So, you know, hopefully the series guys can come out and race and, you know, lock Absolutely. themselves in that race. Then we also are welcoming here for the first time ever the Ohio Valley Legend Series. Oh, nice. I saw that. Yep. Yes. This is the second furthest track they go from their home base. So they're going to come down and they already asked me for hotel information. Oh, so cool. already Gave them all the quality and information. Excellent. Told them, you know, where they can go and get that right, and get themselves right. a room. Okay. So this is their season championship, their point season championship. So they're expecting to bring us quite a few cars and good racing as the guys want to win that title. Excellent. So they're coming to join us too. Looking cool. That's to fantastic. That. Yep. Uh, my favorite is always concessions. Of course, tell us about concessions. Um, usual stuff. Yep. Snappy tomato pizza, cheese and pepperoni. Nice. The uh, Italian sausage, peppers and onions, Absolutely. Um, the, hot dogs, chili dogs, chili favorites, cheese, all right, the nachos, right. popcorn, chips, candy, Pepsi products, so on Drinks, and so forth. Yep. You know, um, my wife works really hard out there in a the concession with all the vendors. She and does. Things have been tough sure. getting supplies because uh, they sure. don't have them. Right. Prices are going up. Yep. Um, nonstop every time she right. orders. But, you know, she had the place stocked last week to race, mm -hmm. right. which is something else that people don't realize that, mm -hmm. you know, when we canceled on Friday because of the wet grounds, we already had fully stocked concessions. Already There's all planning our that has to take place. Yes, you know, you know. It, everything had already been sure. done. You know, we sure. were ready to go. We just couldn't get on a racetrack. Right. So, Absolutely. You know, she's been working out there pretty much every day again this week, getting things ready to go, and, you know, we'll have the concession ready to rock right. and roll. Uh, the website, uh, social information, everything is on there. Give us the details about that. And one more time, everything racing this weekend, Bill. Yes. Uh, Damn Yankees 50. Chapter 1 Realty Group, Pro Late Models, 5,000 win. Nice. Eagle Finance, UMP Modifieds, 1,000. American Racer South Super Suck Series, 1,200. Ohio Valley Legend Series. Uh, we're going to open a pit gate at 2. Adults are 40. Excellent. 6 to 12, Excellent. 20. We're going to open a grandstand at 4. 
Um, adults are 20, 12 and under free, and our plan is to roll off right at 6 o'clock. Excellent. All that information is on the website, social media, Twitter. Yes. Bill does, and his team does a great job with that, it's as well me. as graphics and everything. <laughs> I say team, Bill. It takes a team. Yeah. And, and the racing team. Uh, everything is there. Come on out, folks. There's racing this weekend. The weather's going to be fantastic. Yes. And we do want to thank uh, 28 Designs, Ken Short, for the yep, absolutely. beautiful posters he makes us, which I sent you to. Yep, um, That you'll Excellent. see here on the screen. And, Excellent. you know, he does a great job for that. And Josh Smith, with his Finish First Designs, are keeping our website up to date. I send him the information, and he gets cool. it on there for me. And, you know, Excellent. but the social media stuff's all me, unfortunately. <laughs> it's him. The team of two. <laughs> That's it. Or team of one. Team of is, one. Okay, all right. Team of one. Hey, uh, folks, this weekend, racing, Richmond Raceway. Thanks for watching this week's episode of Richmond Race Week at the Richmond Raceway, sponsored by Jack Burford Chevrolet. Get out and race, everybody. Thanks, Bill. <clears throat> you got it.